Jesus Christ is crap at me. Wait, how many spurs did I have? Uh, 11. I haven't reached my career high yet. There was six. Well, five and two. Five and two spurs. Finish over 500. That's a win, ain't it? Ooh, arm strength. I'm gonna. Hmm. That's kind of good too. Said again, oh, Ooh, I like that break. I mean, that uh, arm strength. A manager checks in with his ball club. What a guy! What a guy. I'm nine and two. Ooh, we're a game under five hundred. We need this win to put us back at five hundred. We need this win to put us back at five hundred. Here in Miami, in Lone Depot Park. MLB the show with a good one coming at you. It's the Cincinnati Reds taking on the Miami Marlins. John Shabby and Chris Singleton with you. So the Cincinnati Reds have taken oh, the first two right. games of this series. And today up. they'll go for the sweep. Miami. They played well, Chris, and they're looking for more of the same in this one. Yeah, they've been the side shaking hands on the field after each game so far. Played solid baseball to earn those wins, as you said. But every game offers up its own unique challenges. So we'll see what those are today. But there's always a little extra motivation when you have an opportunity to sweep a series. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Just about set to go now. Starting on the mound in this one, Frank Tanana. Chris, how about a scouting report? Well, last time out, picked up the win, didn't allow a run, pitched extremely well. He doesn't have to be perfect, but if he can give another performance like last time out, his team will be happy. Oh, yeah, did do good last time. So just about set. Now it's the DH. Max Schreiber. Right off the afternoon for Cincinnati. The designated hitter, Max. The wide to kick the pitch. Swing and a miss. And away we go this afternoon. And he deals. Hey. Strike two. Hey, no outs now. Ooh, right down the pipe. And that one hammered way back there. Fish, fish, fish. Nice running catch. That thing just hung up. India. Jonathan India, the next to hit. He's got four hits in the series on nine at bats. You're nothing. There we got one. We got 455. Lifted in the air, right field. Garcia moving under this one. Now it's 400. Makes the catch. And there's two down. In the series, four in the that in third. The two outs, base is empty. Tyler. And here's the catcher, Tyler Stevenson. Pitch misses inside. Ball one. Kicks and deals. And that one a little bit high. No Come score on, just guy. getting started top of the first. Come on, guy. That's hard hit in the line. No shot. 
trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And the inning is over. Reds go down quietly. And now the Marlins will have a crack. Top of the second, Aristides Aquino now. Leading off from Cincinnati. Tenana back to work. Aristides. Ball one, no strikes. Hey, no outs. No outs now. The pitch. And there's the strike. Kenny no, Jansen doing home plate duties in this one. Got a huge strike zone from Jansen, on, so guys. he can't really be called a pitcher's umpire, but he does like the bottom part of the strike zone. We may see some pitchers steal a few yeah, strikes yeah, down there, especially the ones right below the knees. That's if their catcher can present it properly. How do you get a piece Popped of that? Up, foul yeah, territory no. behind the play. Chris, the players ever change their approach in meaningful ways based on who's umpiring, or is it good to just be aware of tendencies so you're not that surprised? I'd say the latter because got pitchers got to pitch to his strengths regardless. The hitters got to hit to his strength. So you're aware of it, but you have to just hunt for what you can handle. Here's Mike Moustakis to hit. Mike As the game has moved along, we Ball see more and more now, now. information supplied by teams about the umpires. I've been in clubhouses where they have pictures yeah. of all four guys, nicknames, hometowns, and as well, hobbies listed, go, just so you can kind of small talk the umpire a little bit. <laughs> That's great. No score here in the second. And a swing and a miss. Two down. Oh, that slider wasn't even close to the strike zone, and he got him to chase. That's just a bad approach right there. Either he was looking for something else and got completely fooled, or he was sitting all over the slider and just couldn't resist the temptation. But, man, really expanded right there and didn't have a chance to make the contact with that pitch. Next one is off the plate. One and one. Here we go right now, fellas, right now. The wind of the pitch. Chopped left side. Escobar with the throw to third. Wow. That's the third out. And one, two, three, go the Reds. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. Top half of the third inning. And the batter now, Yu Chang. Wow. Tenana, back to work. There's a strike. Well, every pitcher wants a run support, and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some guys. I think keeping the mindset to attack instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse Go after hitters and get quick outs. Next pitch is inside, and a count one and two. Hey, no outs now. Mm. And one gone. Right on the black. Felt definitely a borderline pitch right there, and he didn't look too convinced as he headed back to the dugout. You know, those are tough ones to let go as a hitter, but with the human umpire calling balls and strikes, it's always going to be on you to protect yourself with two strikes. The lefty, the 1 0. -oh. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. Come on, fellas, let's go. Mm, slow down and a 1 1. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. One down, base is empty. That one just misses. Two balls, two strikes. Left hand batter waits. Oh my. High in the air, out to right. Garcia going back on this one. Come he hit that like he knew it was coming. And there's two down. Two outs, base is empty. Joey Votto getting ready to Joey hit. Freaking Votto. Swings through that one. Oh, one, oh, one. Hey, two out. And a pitch. That misses the zone, and it's a ball and a strike. Here we go, boys. And there's the strike. Two outs. Swing and a bouncer. Grabs it barehanded, fires to first, and that's a nice play to end the inning. Reds down. Back here at Lone Depot Park. 
And now the DH, Max Schrock. The pitch. I hate the DH. In for a strike. Strike really one. Do. Here we go, guys. And Let's go. here it comes. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Martinez under got it, got it, got it. it. And a quick out, number one. I hate the DH. I hate the interleague play. The batter number six. Second base. Jonathan. Jonathan India at the plate. Here we go, guys. Ball First one. offering misses the mark. Here we got one. That Aye. clips the inside corner for a strike. Generally, second, third time through the lineup, you want to be able to lean on those secondary pitches and command them. Looks like One he's ball, doing a nice job of it. Straight. Stays alive. Pitch is popped it. up. You Makes the it. grab for the second out. The batter, the catcher. Tyler. Two outs, base is empty. And now, Tyler right Stevens. Right 0 for 1 so far. This to third. Anderson handles. Sends it to first. And the Reds go 1 2 3. Nobody left for Cincinnati. They continue to trail 7 0. Why did I look? That's the way to pitch. Back here in Miami, ready now for the fifth inning, and ready to hit now for Cincinnati. Aristides Aquino. Get ahead, stay ahead now. Aristides Aquino. Got no one. Pitch. And first offering is fouled off. Now yeah. on and on. Looks like he's still trying to find a consistent release point in that curveball. That one just sort of popped out of his hand. No real command and finish to it. It's going to be real important for him to finish that pitch, throw it down in the zone where he wants to, if it's going to be effective for him throughout this game. Broken back. Cooper picks it up, and he just beats him to the bag, gets the out. He wins the foot race there. Good slider inside right there. Batter fighting to get there, just rolled over it, got the ground ball. Mike Moustakis, the next to hit for the Reds. Here we go, guys. First pitch, just misses. Ground ball to the right side. And that's just foul. The Reds yet to pick up a hit here. Next offering upstairs. Well, it's been a very impressive outing so far. His command has been a big part of it. Even when he misses, he misses outside the strike zone, which is exactly what a pitcher wants. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. Now it's Nick Senzel. The center fielder, Nick Senzel. First pitch, not close. There we go. And now the lefty. All right. Pounding ball here, rolls foul. pitch a swing and a soft oh, a base now he's hit so he gets on base and keeps it going anything but pretty right there but he'll take it every time just to flare down that right field line and he got it to drop in oh, fair. I guarantee you, he was yelling yeah. get down get down as he ran out of the box because boog sometimes you just got to talk to him in the dirt but kept close no advance good job behind the dish Here comes a pitch. 
And there's a strike on the outside corner. Two here. Senzel off of first with two away. No Next back. offering is down low. Oh, he's so way too early on that. As he was out front that time. Foul ball, he stays alive. At the belt and fire. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Reds leave one. Not going their way. It's 7 nothing. Back here at the ballpark. And now the right fielder, Austin Hendrick. Tenana back to work. There's a strike. Hendrick. And a pitch. One and one. Hey, we got no one. Wait. Out towards left center. Oh, no. Sanchez. Drop steps, heads back on. Mm -hmm. Long run. Nice grab. And there's one down. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when go, the guys, game comes, go. they make the play perfectly. Votto swings through that one oh, no, as he comes to the play for the second time today. Oh, and one now. There's a strike. Well, on the mound, very efficient, able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at bat. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. So he's gotten deep into this game, and at least so now far, that, not showing a ton of signs of Max fatigue. Schrock. Next is the designated hitter, Max Schrock. Hey, come on. Get ahead, stay ahead. Ball and one. the first pitch misses for ball one. Count one and oh. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. And a foul ball. The pitch. Swing and a ball popped up. Ball, ball, ball. And makes the grab. And that is the third out of the inning. Welcome back. We go to the top of the seventh. Now the number two hitter, Jonathan India. The wind of the pitch. Jonathan. And ball one. Bounce to the right. Chisholm collects it in plenty of time to first, and they get the leadoff hitter in the seventh. In now for the Reds, Tyler Stevenson. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. And that one is in for a strike. We got one here. Oh, two is the count. The O2. Mm, damn it, one one and two. Stays alive. Wait. Now that's back to right center. Racing makes the catch. Two away. Two outs, bases empty. Here's the left fielder, Aristides Aquino. First offering, and it just misses. Let's go now. Let's go. Let's go. A wind and a pitch. And that's in there at the knees. Swing and a miss. And a count. One and two. Two down. Two down. Two down. Nobody on. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And that'll do it. And one, two, three. Go the Reds. They continue to trail. Seven up. We're at the top of the eight. Here's the third baseman. Mike Moustakis. Get ahead. Stay ahead now. The wide to kick the pitch. And that's a strike across the top of the zone. Hey, 
Comes up empty on the swing. 0 and 2 now. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Oh, that slider down and away. It's just kind of a slow death. With two now strikes, you're looking to protect, and halfway to the mid. plate, you know you've committed, yeah. and you know you're going to have no chance of touching it. Tell you what, sometimes you just have to tip your cap. Digging in, it's the speedy outfielder, Nick Senzel. One for two. That's a strike. And first offering is fouled off. In there for a strike at the hey, bottom of the zone. Here. And the pitch. That misses the zone. It's a ball and two strikes. One and two. And he deals. On the ground, right side. Chisholm tosses the first. Two up, two down here in the top of the eighth. Now batting. Now here is Yu Chang. Who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Two down, two down. Ooh. Line drive. Makes the play, and it's out number nice. three. Reds go down quietly. Not going their way. It's seven nothing. That's the way to show a lot of things. Excuse me, hit. I like giving up. Back here at Lone Depot Park. Now it's the right fielder, Austin Hendrick. Tenana back to work. And a good eye there. That's through there for a strike. In this situation, you expect hey, the batters to be a little more patient, possibly take until they get a strike. With that, you don't want to miss your opportunity to get ahead early in the count. He didn't right there. The pitch. And now the count is even. Hey, need a strikeout right here. It's your guy. And a pitch. Oh, my. He hit that hard. That's back. And that one hops the wall. Safe at second with a leadoff double. Put a pretty good swing on that one as he drove it out to deep left. Right, Didn't man. quite have the right combination of launch angle and exit velocity to get it over the fence, but you're never going to be disappointed with extra bases. Votto up to the plate for the third time as he looks at one down low. Next offering is in for a strike. Well, the leadoff man gets on. Got you want to minimize right the Let's threat go. by playing sound defense. Hopefully the pitcher can get a ball on the ground and they can roll him up for two. Here's a 2-1. And that one fouled off. Hendrick at second with nobody out. Hey, we got nobody. Squeezes it, and there's one down. Oh, that's a frustrating end to the at-bat for the hitter right there. I mean, that pitch was right down the middle. I think he got a little too excited, came out of his mechanics. Instead of driving that ball somewhere, he popped it off. Unfortunate for him. Maddock with one down, takes a strike. Strike two. Well, you can't expect to get a great pitch to hit with an open base and a runner on second. He's going to have to really tighten up his sights here, make sure that he can barrel up the ball. Martinez puts it away, and there's two away. Well, what's amazing that he's just now about to throw his 100th pitch, and that's something that he can be really proud of when this thing's open. Jonathan India, the next to hit for the Reds. That one hammered, but pulled foul. Aww. Line drive. Base hit. Pendry coming oh, home. Sure long throw home. <laughs> Got him. Nice. It has become increasingly difficult to throw a complete game shutout because of all of the offensive prowess that these hitters are showing around the league today. But he had total command of this game, and he saw it all the way through to the end. Nice win. This one ends 7-0. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shami. We'll see you soon. Here now is our final line score for this afternoon.
Oh, why I didn't kill me uh, my thing magic for some reason. 101 pitches. Nice. 10 strikeouts. Oh, I'm moving. I'm moving on up to the east side. Oh, All right, that's it for that. 